Epic everyone more Valley Dunk Wrestling 24-7. I am Ken Ron back in the booth now, and this next matchup is for the Jewel Championship. Claire defending the title against Alexis Raven. She wanted uh, to have Alexis Raven in a matchup because Alexis Raven decided to go tell the one about all the plans tonight about adding me into the title match and everything. So Claire wanted the match, but the one put the title on the line. That might have been uh, a little bit of misinformation going around that Claire was going to put the title on the line. Claire didn't want to give Alexis Raven a title shot because Alexis Raven hasn't been in Valley Dunn Wrestling for very long, but she gets a title shot because of the one now, and it looks like Charade has been named the special guest referee, which I don't know how fair that's going to be. Because, I mean, we all know Charade can't be unbiased. She doesn't like Claire, and we all know that. And Brutal Impact's had an issue with Claire for a while, as here comes the Jewel Champion. And Claire, I believe, has made history in Valley Dung Wrestling in the Jewel Division for quite a number of times. She's been Jewel Champion multiple times. And when Claire has challenged for the Jewel Championship, she's never lost a matchup where she was the challenger. So she's undefeated in that regard. She's held the title at least three times, and I think that's a record. I don't know of any other woman in the Jewel division that's ever held the belt three times. So Claire has, has that going for her, but tonight, I mean, Alexis Raven is a, a rookie by many standpoints. So Alexis Raven getting a title shot like this, I think she's way, way out of her league, way overmatched. And here comes Alexis Raven, of course, Alexis Raven, a uh, adult film star. She's had many different roles, but I mean, coming here to Valley Dunk Wrestling, this is something that's not easy, but going against Claire, I mean, she shouldn't have stayed out of Claire's business, but she didn't want to do that. She wanted to stick her nose where it didn't belong and try to join up with that alliance of sorts. And now it looks like this abuse of power by the one now, because the one didn't walk out of here with the interim championship. And GL, I guess he does have the interim title, but I think it's now a moot point. The interim championship was a moot point because the mad professor made his return because he got tired of seeing all the title changes for the interim title. He wanted to go in and come back and show everybody what a true champion is. His vacation ended, he's recharged, he's ready. And there's Charade holding that jewel title belt, showing off the belt. So, hopefully, hopefully this doesn't affect the match too much. But having Charade in there, I don't really agree with. As the match starts off, and Claire going right to work on Alexis Raven. Now, she, it looks like she's going to give Alexis Raven a little bit of a wrestling lesson here tonight. And Alexis Raven, I mean, she, she got lucky to get this opportunity here. And oh, right off the apron there. Claire knocks Alexis Raven out of the ring, and Alexis Raven is a little bit surprised by this, as looks like Claire is still in the ring, and now Claire's getting ready for something big. It's, oh, she misses a, a high-risk move that went the wrong way, but I think that Charade's probably taunting or doing something to get under Claire's skin and try to throw Claire off of her game, but Claire now going right back to work on Alexis Raven here on the outside. I guess there are no counts, and oh, right into those steel steps goes Alexis Raven. And she's going to learn tonight that you don't go messing with the Jewel Champion right off the bat. And possibly, maybe the one will see that, you know, trying to put Claire in a matchup where she's not prepared. Oh, right through the barricade, trying to put the title on the line when Claire didn't expect the title to be on the line. Might backfire here as Claire... Goes right through the barricade, and Claire's still wearing her general manager attire. She doesn't have her ring attire here tonight. She didn't plan on having to uh, defend her title. As that, oh, right into those steel steps goes Alexis Raven, and now a cover, but looks like Charade was hesitating there on the count. Probably saved Alexis Raven there on that exchange, and now right into the corner goes Alexis Raven's head. And Claire really just taking full and total control in this matchup. And I think 
Obviously, the referee should have stopped this matchup because Alexis Raven, I don't think she's got. And now, Claire with another cover, a pinfall attempt, but Charade again hesitates to make the count and, and allows Alexis Raven to survive for now. But Claire is now delivering those kicks and punches. Well executed moves here on Alexis Raven. And I don't know what Alexis Raven can. Oh, and there goes Charade down. And now. Looks like Claire's going to give Charade a little bit of a lesson. Takes it to Charade, and Charade, she's going to learn not to be, uh, you know, biased in the matches of Claire. Claire sends Charade into the corner, and Charade, <clears throat> now in the corner, as now Claire's going to go to work on Alexis Raven again, as Alexis Raven is now down on the ring apron and pulled off the ring apron and now outside of the ring, and now Claire is taking apart that commentary table and it looks like perhaps Alexis Raven and Claire are going to battle on top of that commentary table and now Claire with a looks like a Samoan drop as she oh right through that table and now Alexis Raven has got to be in even more pain and this matchup Claire just seems to be showing a mean streak here as now cover one no and a kick out but Charade, that was a very, very slow count there by Charade. She's trying to deliver seemingly a slow, deliberate count. Probably trying to um, get in Claire's head or do something. But I don't think, I hope that this doesn't, I hope that she doesn't uh, try to do anything screwy here. But it looks like Alexis Raven now has gotten a second win and she slaps Claire. And now goes for some type of a, that's a weird maneuver there. Oh, down goes Claire and now a cover. One and oh, and a kick out there by Claire. I thought for sure there for a minute, but Alexis, oh wait, Claire's got a kick. Oh, right to the back of the head. And now a cover. One, two, no, and a kick out again there by Alexis Raven. As Alexis Raven is hurting <coughs> for sure. As now she sends Claire up and over the top rope. And now Alexis Raven doing a little bit of taunting of her own. But Alexis Raven seemingly... Is starting to get a little bit of momentum going, so Claire's got to find some way to stop that momentum, to slow this momentum down, to slow this match down somehow, and make sure that Alexis Raven doesn't get too much going, as it looks like Claire is taking the belt into the ring. It looks like she's going to introduce the championship into this matchup, but no, it gets knocked away as Claire grabs the championship belt again, but looks like Alexis Raven has the title belt in hand. That's not her belt. She's not the champ. Oh, and she nails Claire in the back of the head. But that belt, that is that is theft right there. That is not your property, Alexis Raven. And she nailed Claire in the back of the head with the belt as Claire grabs her belt back. And this jewel title match is just... Oh, wait a second. Alexis Raven grabs the belt again. And now she's rubbing Claire's face against the title belt. And Claire... Oh, slammed down hard and now nailed with the title belt. Why isn't the referee calling for a disqualification? Clearly, and oh, a slap to the face and a kick to the head. Kick to the jaw there by Alexis Raven on Claire. And now Alexis Raven with a backdrop right onto the back of Claire. And it looks like Claire might be down and out from that move. And now a cover. No one a kick out there again. Claire just barely getting up out of that. And now Alexis Raven takes her down yet again. As looks like Alexis Raven is picking up Claire and goes for the vision. That's a move out of the ones playbook. And Alexis Raven, oh, with a, with a swan ton bomb. And now cover one, two, and three. And I cannot believe this. We have a new jewel champion. Alexis Raven wins the championship from Claire. But the, there was shady officiating there. And that vision. I mean, that, that's gimmick infringement there by Alexis Raven using the vision of all moves to take down Claire. And, and I can't believe this. The one should have never allowed this title match to go through. But I guess with all the things that we had going on, we didn't see that the one had made it a title match until now. It was too, now it's too late. But you know what? Claire does have an automatic rematch at some point. But Alexis Raven now celebrating the victory as Charade pretends like she's checking on Claire. But Alexis Raven celebrating this big victory. But you know what? I think Alexis Raven now, she's drawn a target on her. 
and I'm sure that there will be payback coming, so Alexis Raven, enjoy your title reign while it lasts.